you all must know by now, uh, well, maybe not the babies in the room, they probably don't know this, but Patricia and Will are legally married and had a beautiful, intimate Vietnamese wedding a year ago tomorrow. So today, we are here to, I don't know, assess how it's going. <laughs> uh, no, no. Uh, um, we are here together to celebrate that and to celebrate their enviable, limitless love and partnership, one that for all those who know them well, seemed inevitable. As someone who enjoys talking, being eloquent, and generally saying more than I know, I was utterly perplexed when it came down to composing my vows. Kind of like how a dentist would feel when trying to remove number 11 without breaking the buckle plate. Because how do you adequately describe all the incredible, overwhelming, and completely life-changing feelings that you can have for one person? Who you would do anything to spend the rest of your life with? How do you describe the amazing feeling of joy you feel when you get to go on an epic trip with the best travel partner, as well as the immense comfort you feel snuggling up with them on the couch on a cold night watching a movie? How do you describe the yearning you feel when you get up and their warmth is gone because they had to go to work? Or the longing and dread you feel when you try to even imagine having a life without them. There's both too many and not enough words to convey all the feelings I have for you that I wouldn't give up for anything in the world. I spent years looking for someone who I would want to devote my entire heart to. And little did I know she was right in front of me this entire time. Patricia, you epitomize every synonym of amazing of any person I have ever known in my entire life. I vow to love you, protect you, support you, and love you again. As cliche as this may sound, I mean it with every fiber of my being that I want to spend the rest of my life with you. Every minute, every hour, every year, every millennia. And I am the luckiest man in the entire galaxy. It's a light, it's a light touch, light touch, light touch. Hey, oh my god, you, you look so beautiful. Do you actually like the dress? I do actually. But you hate this. <laughs> you hate this style. About? What are you talking about? No, here, spin. Yeah, no, I cannot spin. Oh, you cannot no, spin. No, look, I spin you. <laughs> Good job. Will, I tell you every day, a hundred times a day, that I love you. But as this is our wedding, I'll say it again, but in the way that you love it best. Will, I love you very much. You're my butter half. I love you from my head to my toes. Please don't go bacon my heart, though I know you couldn't if you fried. Thank you for existing, Will. And I'm excited to live our apple ever after. He loves apples, in case you didn't know. 
I promise to laugh at your puns only if they're funny. <laughs> I promise to always hold your hand during the scary part with the spiders on the Harry Potter ride at Universal Studios. I know you'll hold mine during the Dementors. I promise to lift your dreams, ground them in reality, and help you bring them to fruition. I promise to tell you whenever I'm craving pizza, tacos, or pho. I strive to be as patient, kind, and thoughtful as you, and I promise to bring that to every day in our lives, especially in the kitchen. And I promise to bring as much joy as you do. I love you, Will, and I'm so happy that in, <laughs> that in this life, I get to do laundry and taxes with you. By the power vested in me by absolutely no one, <laughs> except gratefully by the two of you, it is my great pleasure to pronounce you married. Please kiss each other. <laughs> Friends, family, it's Patricia and Will. <laughs> 